Hey guys, so today I'm doing another lip test out, a six hour wear challenge. And today the weapon of choice is Pretty Zombie Cosmetics, this color, which is Dahlia. It's a kind of maroni based brown. It's much darker than the one I did yesterday, which was Jeffree Star's Calabasas. So I'm very interested to see how a darker formula works, but obviously I'm going to do this with a Jeffree Star one as well, because my theory of long wearing only kind of works in lighter colors should be tested on the same brand it's not really fair to jump to a completely different brand and say hey this works really well or really badly i've never done this kind of comparison so i'm going to test out everything that i own it's going to take me a few weeks just to get through that but i'm pretty sure that will be a really good way for me to discover what my favorites are it's super cute today literally the first time i've plaited my hair since like first grade it is 12 o'clock, we are heading to lunch for my mother's birthday. This is how it looks, I've just put it on. Pretty Zombie Cosmetics are one of my favorite smaller, I don't know if they're still indie. I don't know at what point a brand doesn't become indie. <laughs> they're a lot smaller, they're not sold at Sephora or anything like that. I think you have to get them directly from their website or they have a few retailers. Um, one in Australia I can think of is Berserk. It is a very hydrating, very, very creamy formula and I'm pretty sure it does not flake at all and that's something I really dislike in a lipstick as I mentioned in my first video. So let's go eat something and see how this baby goes. Six hours. Oh, did you just say hello to your daycare? You're super cute, buddy. Say hi, Steel. Hey. I love that. We were here a long time ago. Hey, let's go find Grandma. Where are they? They're over the back there. Go, go, go. Keep walking. Happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you, darling. So this is first drink of the day. Oh, so it's coming off. Yeah. Yes, it's but it's not noticeable on my lips yet. So All right, lunch has arrived. Let's see how this does. That's my third bite. Hmm. I'm not sure if there's going to be much left when I finish this. So I'm sipping on some water here. And it is coming off straight away. You can't tell on my lips, but it is coming off on the cup. My dad is wondering what the hell am I doing? Say hi. Please subscribe to her channel. Yes, please. <laughs> I'm not sure how this is looking in the sunlight. Okay, the time is now two o'clock and for a dark color and me eating lunch, it is still on my lips. Something that was very different to what I did yesterday with Jeffree Star's one was the placement of lunch. I literally put this on, I drove to the cafe and then I ate straight away. I don't know if that is a problem. I mean, you don't know when you're going to eat. So I don't know how consistent I can be with that, but with yesterday's one, I had it on for two hours and then I ate. So of course it seems like that one's doing better right now in comparison, but it's truly not comparable unless I eat lunch at the same time. So anyway, hopefully we don't have to be that um, finicky about it. So it is spreading a little bit in the sides. Still keeping it shape pretty well. Now we are going to take the kids to kid zone, have some fun. They are both looking pretty tired. Hi, Bum Bum. <laughs> Hi, Bum Bum. So we've decided on the red, even though I was like, oh, I don't want to do it. But it's Mommy, much. can you move? Right or red? Yes, I can move, sweetheart. Think, okay, are you just I testing it out? Yeah, I'm rolling on it. Okay, like Mommy, you would at home. Okay, so it is now 2.30. I put this on again at 12 o'clock. I'm just about to have my first hot drink of the day, a hot chocolate. Um, when I get to the bottom of the cup, I will show you how the transfer goes. Oh, fuck it, I'll just do it now. Minimal. It's performing pretty well, I think. Ready, Sonny? We are just leaving kids zone they've had a whole bunch of fun and it's still looking all right isn't it all right it is four o'clock i've just come back home from being out with the kids and like i was saying in my first jeffree star video this isn't how you would use the product this is a test on how long wearing it is if you are caught in a tight spot and you can't redo your lipstick for whatever reason how is it going to perform okay so the sides kind of bled out a little bit there. It does, it feels very creamy. You know when some lipsticks start to flake off, they feel, I was talking about this yesterday, they feel flaky. They just flake off in little bits. This feels 
It's very moisturizing, but it's almost slimy. I guess that's why it's coming off when I eat or when I uh, drink things like that. It's kind of sliding off. <laughs> that's a way to explain it where um, I'm sure I will try one eventually that cracks to show you the difference. It literally cracks off every time you touch the surface of anything. And honestly, in the right light, I think I can still get away with it looking pretty decent. See, it's been on for four hours. I've eaten, I've had a cup of tea, a milkshake, and just some ice cordial. So it is five o'clock. I'm in my office trying to catch up on some emails and doing some design work. It feels okay, you know? Even the kiss test, that's okay. This, that's after five hours. Yeah, there's a little bit there, but that's to be expected. But the bulk of the color is still... There we go, yeah, shit, I'm like, you can't see me. It's still on my lips, right? And that's what we're trying to test out at this point in time. So I'm, I'm actually really impressed for a dark color. <laughs> the more of these I do, the more I will understand the difference in the formulas. Then I will be able to give you a stronger opinion based upon my findings in the videos that I do. So this is only my second lip swatch, but yeah, so far I'm really impressed. So I'm gonna give it another 15 minutes and I will check back in with you guys at the end. Oh, a middle of your scene is too cold. Oh, sorry about that. Hey guys, the time is six o'clock. We've made it to six hours with one application of this. So, Mommy, what's this? Very nice. Got my nose. Is it still on? Yes. Would I say that this is long wearing? Yes. Like this is one application of it. When I'm putting it on, I'm literally using the wand and I'm getting the shape that I want and I'm applying it That's once. Not a, you're not using a wand. Yeah, this is what they call it, the applicator, the applicator wand. So this is just a straight wand in case you're interested. I'll put my hand there so you can see it. It has a slight tip at the end. It is um, probably the same length as the Jeffree Star one, not as long as the Kat Von D Everlasting. Mommy, if you've got some of hers. So what are my thoughts? I am very impressed. Like I knew that Pretty Zombie Cosmetics were one of the best that I have tried so far, just in regards to the formula. So if you haven't tried them, please do. The colors, the range is beautiful and I highly recommend this one. And how cute is the packaging? Focus, we've got a little zombie in a coffin. Which is just a sticker on the label so not as fancy as some of the higher end brands but you can understand why when they're a small business that kind of insane packages that the bigger brands have you know they produce maybe five hundred thousand, and this is like handmade by someone so it's very different and it's good to support brands that are actually doing really good stuff so again this is dahlia i saw this on another girl on instagram and i just fell in love and you do that thing where you buy a lipstick thinking yeah i loved it on that person then you wear it and you're like oh doesn't look as good on me <laughs> so does it feel slimy yes can I lick it and it'll not come off on my tongue or my teeth yes has it come off onto my teeth at all no did it transfer to cups yes but funnily enough the first time I drank it's like it transferred a lot and then it kind of stopped transferring if I kiss at this point on a tissue wow even that is not enough so go and check them out if you haven't already. If you haven't watched my first video on this type of six hour wear review type thing, it is on Jeffree Star's Calabasas. So I will put the link at the end of the video so you can watch that one. Can you say please subscribe to my channel? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Yeah, if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to my channel. Click the um, click that little bell so you get notified when I actually upload a video. And I'm having fun making these. Um, I'm gonna keep the ball rolling. I'm going to do all of my lipsticks so I can literally say I've used every one of them and there was a purpose, a reason behind me actually buying them. Because what is the purpose of a lipstick? It's to fucking wear it, so I need to do some wearing. So that's what this is about. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.